Yep, just a little back. Yeah. All right, next up is the Kino Flow Fluorescent Diva Light Kit, or just Kino. This kit has two Kino lights, two light stands, two Flosiers for diffusion, and an extra set of bulbs for different color temperatures. After you break out your stands, grab your light and attach at this elbow. Lock the light into place with this knob and change the angle of the light with this lever right here. Now, just carefully open the barn doors, run your electrical, strike the light, and you're good to go. To change the color of the bulbs in your Kino, first you need to pull up on the grill and egg crate tabs with this Velcro on the top. Next, press down on this red tab right here at the top of the bulb first in order to get the bulb out from the socket. Next, place your thumb on this metal hook right here and out comes your Kino bulb. Grab your new bulb out of the case and align with the electrical here. Push the bulb into place and make sure it's secure. Now just replace your grill and egg crate. These lights also have a knob on the back in order to easily adjust intensity. It's like they thought of everything. The included flosiers can be thrown onto the light to add diffusion. And there you have it. Once finished with your chute, let the light cool down first. Depending on how long you've used it, it could take up to 30 minutes to cool down enough to safely put away. Wrap your power cords neatly and you must make sure no cords are in the way of any pinch points of the case closing. Return your equipment how you found it. At the end of the day, just treat our equipment with respect. Thanks everyone for watching. We hope to see you around ETV, but for now, happy filming.